Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from spirit uh, for all of us who are all on this journey to love and to reunite with our divine vibrational matches in this lifetime. And uh, the last video, as a lady, thank you very much, made a comment on the video to say that the last letter, 108, is actually the 17th day in April. So I was like, okay, I'm going to read letter 17 then and also share love mantra 17, which is our bodies, our souls, our oneness is what we were created for. Hmm. So that's from the love mantra book that I do. And then I'm going to do a magic one as well, just to remember today I live the magic of my soul. So those are the two matches for today. Today I live the magic of my soul and uh, the other one was, I've forgotten, it's just gone out of my head. Our bodies, our souls, our oneness is what we were created for. So with this whole like planetary shift that's going on at the moment we are seeing uh, more and more how connected we are so the message is grandmother earth <laughs> look at that uh, that just reminds me of cherry blossom seeing all that pink blossom so let's see what grandmother earth guidance what she has for us grandmother energy has been very 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 strong recently so car the meaning is stop and take measure of your life assess who you are and where you are get grounded make plans for the future but don't act on those plans until you are ready and feel secure in stepping forward there is a profound source of strength and power within you and it is expanding now so put your roots down this is the time of preparation and going deeper and your native spirit wants you to know that grandmother earth provides the trees the plants the flowers the rivers the streams, the oceans, the mountains and valleys, and supports all, all of us with her, with her bounty. She is stable and strong in her devotion to us. You are supported and loved, even if you're not always sure of it. Strength is growing within you, so don't rush. Slow down. The seeds that you plant now will bring abundance in the future, but only if you take the time to nurture those new beginnings. Take time to plan your future carefully. Don't rush into anything. Security and protection surround you. You are safe. If you're thinking of making secure financial investments and receive this card, it's telling you that this is a good time to do so and it's not a time to take risks. And the journey is to deepen your connection to Grandmother Earth and bring security in all forms into your life. Walk barefoot on the earth, place your hands in the earth or make investments. Imagine the strengthening, grounding energy of the earth filling you and your life. So very important message to say, feel connected to the earth. So I know that lots of us at these times will feel financially, um, uh, what's the word, financially um, uh, unsteady, let's say. And so that's why the message of this card is to say, feel grounded by Mother Earth, who's going to be supporting you in your abundance. Um, very strong message, especially at the moment for all of those who are self-employed, you know, who are fighting to keep their businesses afloat. Um, then make sure that you're feeling connected to Mother Earth to help you to create uh, that abundance. So I am going to share letter 17 from the Divine Love Letter books. These are all channeled messages. The reason why 17, when I saw the lady make a comment in a video, I was, I instantly knew because I've also, I know whose letter one of these letters is. And I'd also recently done a letter for her. So um, very strong when people come and I've already read their letter then. It's like a, like the twin spirit really, really wanting to get in contact, right? So, letter 17, that everything that she has an inkling about, she should believe. She knows the truth. You know the truth about us, about me, about our time and our path together. You need to trust that what you feel is right, even though it doesn't make any sense to your logical brain how you know that. But that's the thing. That's the greatest lesson of all that love defies all logic. There is no explaining it. There is no judgment in it. There is no pain in love. 
when you really focus on the love and not the fact that we're not together in our bodies, when you focus on your heart and the fact that we have always been together, saving each other and guiding each other to the light, always, always there, right by each other's side, in times of need, in times of joy, in times of sadness, across all time, space and realities. We are one. Oh, wow. Look at that. Ah, oh, that's brilliant. What was the uh, mantra? Our oneness is what we were created for. <laughs> brilliant. Uh, okay, so that is number one. Number two. Seventeen is this. I simply adore you in the simplest way, the truest way, the most honest and wholesome way. Basically, with all of me, I love all of you. It's been a hole in my heart that I've been looking to fill, and I know that my search is over. I know that soon our time will come to fill each other's holes, the holes in our hearts where each other's key fits. We hold the key, the sacred key for one another. That's why we felt like there's something missing, that we've always been on the edge of our life beginning. It's because we give each other the key to complete our life mission. We unlock each other's souls. Okay, so last one. We unlock each other's souls. We hold the key. So, 17, final one, book three. Feel me holding your hand, walking you through this windy path that leads us back to our love. Trust that I am here for you. Trust that what you feel is true. Know that you're not going crazy. I did and do feel the same as you. All of those feelings of true love overwhelmingly indescribable uncontrollable feelings like rushes of adrenaline shooting through our bodies a sense of coming home and then overwhelming terror to think we'd never see each other again all of that we both felt but now the beautiful thing is we never need to feel that feeling of fear and terror and desperation of not seeing each other again because we will be with one another for eternity we are eternally entwined by the heart and soul. There you go. We're eternally entwined by the heart and soul. So I am going to finish by just repeating the magic mantra 17. And it is today I live the magic of my soul. Today I live the magic of my soul. Okay, there you go. I hope that helps. If you want a healing, reading, channeled letter to buy any of these books, all available on Amazon, Amazon help you lift and shift your vibration and uh, help you get into that frequency of divine love so more and more messages can come through from your twin. All right, if I can be of any help, I would love that. So please, all my details are in the link. But in the meantime, stay well. All right, take care. Bye.